In this part of the video, I am going to show you how the ultrasonic sensor, which is this sensor, will stop the robot when it detects an object away by certain distance. How this gonna happen? The first thing I want to say, when I start the program, so I'll go to when program starts, I want my robot to move forward. So I'll go to movement and I will select start moving straight. Start moving straight action is to keep moving forward. What's going to happen, it will continue moving until the ultrasonic sensor. Now we will go to the sensors. Okay. Yeah, we forgot something. Before we make start moving, we have to set the, mo the movement to the PNC, which they are the motor, which are uh, motors controlling the wheels. So let's go back to movement. So we will take set movement motors to B and C. You can see them, the large motors, the lar two large motors. Okay, so make sure that they are B and C as we have here B and C. If in your case is different, then you have to change based on what you have. So we will set the movement to motor B and C and the direction is going to be forward, okay? It will continue moving until the ultrasonic sensor. Now we have to go to the sensor and we have to search for the ultrasonic sensor. So we will continue moving moving and here if you look the ultrasonic sensor is connecting to port number two in this case in this code it's connecting to four so i have to change it to two you need always to check the ports uh, of the your parts so the ultrasonic sensor which is connecting to port two it will wait until the distance is less than 15 centimeter. So let's say that, okay. So the robot will continue moving until the ultrasonic sensor detects an object or something away by 15 centimeter or less than 15 centimeter, what the action is going to be. The action is going to be the robot will stop the movement. Okay, let's try this together. I think the distance, the, the robot did not do any action because the distance is already 15 centimeter. I'll take it back a little bit. Okay. So the robot now stops because it detects, because the ultrasonic sensor, not the robot, robot cannot detect anything. The robot is just a machine. The ultrasonic sensor of the robot detects that there is an object less than 15 centimeters. And that's what I called him to do. Let's say that I want the distance to be less than 15 centimeter. Now, still the object is away by 15 centimeters. I wanna try the 10. Let's minimize the distance. So later we can code it to grab or to, to hold the object. Still, let's try five. Four. Yeah, it should be fine. Okay, so this code, it will help my robot to stop when the ultrasonic sensor detects an object away by less than four centimeter. Okay, question. When we use the start moving here, we didn't say start moving for number of rotation. We did not do that. And the reason for number of rotations, degrees or seconds. And the reason of this, the object might be away by only one rotation. And if I put, for example, four rotations, what's gonna happen is the robot will continue moving and it will hit the object 
okay? Because the robot or the, the system or the code, it, the program reads the code line by line. So it has to finish the four degrees or the four rotations, but then it will uh, go to the next line. So when we use sensors, we never put for number of rotations, degrees, or seconds. 